Guys, welcome back to the vlog. Uh, oh my back. goodness. <laughs> How many times are you do this intro? Uh, this is the second time. I'll do the intro for him. How much you want to bet? I'll get it first. Okay. Whatever. Welcome back to the vlog. Okay, guys, we're going to take some pictures on the mountainside again. Um, but this time, Jonah and Zach are with us. The boys are back. Yeah. You keep your love language on the low. Oh, we need to redo the intro again. Well, <laughs> that was actually a good intro. <laughs> I feel you crumbling my arms down to your heart. Yeah, no. Because sandwich. I'm depressed. <laughs> Dude, you work at a pizza place and own a Jeep. You shouldn't be depressed. Facts. Life's bigger than just cars and money, dude. Right. That was, right, that that was actually really deep. Um, um, it's your be song. In the next Billy Eyelash song. William Eyelash. Featuring Noah Carty. No! William Eyelash. <laughs> Trust me, Zach, you don't want to be in a relationship. Really <laughs> Wait. Wait. <laughs> Jake, keep your eyes on the road! Look at this view again, oh, boys. Is that okay? I know, I thought it heard just better now for a second. <laughs> yeah. Dude, what if... We took an artsy picture where we went like this and the sun came through our finger. Honestly, that would be cool for an Instagram picture, like of, of no, me like, just being like, with this my... Oh, this is a dope shot right here. Heck yeah, dude. It's a dope shot right there behind you guys. I mean, yeah. Whoa. Zach's waiting for her to hit the corner. It will never happen. Let's see it, Zach. Ah! All right, what is good, guy? What? No! What is good, guys? I'm in Noah's house. I spontaneously got some all the new Star Wars collection oh! on Blu-ray. So sick. We got all of them right here. So we got the prequels, we got the originals, and then we got the sequels, and then I got this for my Mac. I got this for my Mac so I can work on songs. And then Nova. Yeah. Okay. This is so sick, dude. I, I love cool. this. Like, my personal favorite is Revenge of the Sith. Either Revenge of the Sith or Empire Strikes Back. Revenge of the Sith is more of a dark movie, but, like, I, I grew up watching this movie a whole lot. Yeah. It's so dope. Okay, first. We need to get rid of all of this. No one, no. No. Okay, guys, so first off, we got The Phantom Menace. And this movie is just pretty much like a first prequel movie. Came out in like 1999 or 98, around there. This just started it off because George Lucas wanted to make another, I don't know, tr like trilogy saying how Darth Vader became Darth Vader. Now we got the second one, Attack of the Clones. Anakin is much older. He's just trying to find out more about himself, I guess, in this one. Still a good movie. Yeah. Still a pretty good movie. Better than The Last Jedi, that's for sure. Oh! Uh, then we got Revenge of the Sith, my personal favorite. Just have pretty much like Anakin's turn to the dark side, because that's obviously what this movie is about. This was like the final like snapping point of like, Anakin and you don't really like root for him kind of like the Joker You don't really like root for what he's doing because you're so attached to him Why it's one of my favorite movies ever and then it goes full circle into like the next like into the originals So next in the timeline we have Solo. This is Han Solo's origin story um, Has a different actor than Harrison Ford. I would have been cool if they had like the little deep aging effect for Harrison Ford mm -hmm. But Harrison Ford's like old so mm -hmm. it's, it's okay. Harrison we also have uh, Donald Glover in this movie as well who played as Lando would have been cool. Billy D. Williams had like the de aging effect, but it's okay. This movie is like a pointless one, but it's still pretty good. I don't know. I first watched it. And my first like impressions, they were, I I liked I liked watching it all the way through. I don't know. It just looked like it. It just looked way better with like the new like um, technology for movies that we have now for the new like HD cameras. It, it makes Star Wars look a whole lot better. Now we have Rogue One, a Star Wars story. Came out the year after um, The Force Awakens. The end takes place like minutes before the events of A New Hope. 
which is what I liked about this movie. I also really liked the, uh, the Darth Vader scenes in this one because they were just absolutely amazing. So now we got the original Star Wars, A New Hope. It was originally just called Star Wars whenever it came out in 1977. And this is just so sick looking back on this. This is actually the first ever movie, like Star Wars movie I've ever watched. And we had it on like VHS as well. Now to you kids who don't know who, what that is, <laughs> that was the thing before CDs. I know, I'm pretty old. Dude, you're pretty swaggy. So yeah, we got The Empire Strikes Back and uh, George Lucas didn't really expect to create a sequel for Star Wars. This was just not called Star Wars The Empire Strikes Back or Episode 5. This was just The Empire Strikes Back. Just absolutely amazing. This was honestly one of the best storylines in Star Wars. At the time, like, the plot twists were amazing, but we know we all know what happens, really. But honestly, this was one of my personal favorite Star Wars movies ever, either, as well. We have Episode 6, Return of the Jedi. It's actually, this movie's actually so good. Episode six is actually like a really good close at the time for Star Wars. It, it, it was supposed to be the close for Star Wars, but then like George Lucas also had some plan for Palpatine to come back. I guess that's why we have the sequels now. Return of the Jedi is not like really about Luke, it's about Anakin, mm -hmm. Darth Vader coming back to the light side, being, being redeemed. So now we have The Force Awakens. I was actually really hyped to see this trailer whenever it dropped in 2015. I was going crazy. I was just so hyped for this movie. When I saw it at first, it was actually really good. I was just excited for the future of Star Wars to see what was going on. This is this is still a good movie, but it's not like one of my personal favorites. And it was good. It was also really good to see like all the original characters come back and how like, but like I didn't like seeing them like how old they were, but still it was it was still good to see them back on reprising their roles. Last but not least, we have The Last Jedi, okay? I have mixed emotions about this movie. I really do. And when it was first, like, announced, I was really hyped. Like, they made these trailers look so good. I did my reaction for The Last Jedi uh, a few years ago. And it was, it was 2017? Yep. Yeah. This movie, I first saw it, I first saw it, I thought it was good. I, I thought it was pretty good, but then I went back and saw it with Jake um, a couple, another time, and um, I saw all the, I saw all the points people were making about this movie and how it wasn't that as good as like the rest. This is probably like, honestly, the worst Star Wars they've ever made. But then we have the Rise of Skywalker. Hopefully that would make things better. I guess I don't know what's going on in that movie. All I know, all I know is that Palpatine is confirmed to come back. But yeah. Hopefully they make it good. Hopefully Anakin comes back because Palpatine's counterpart in the light side is Anakin, so. Dude, that's actually so sick. But yeah, guys, I just love like collecting these kind of movies that I'm actually a really huge fan of. And I know that's what the vlogs have been mostly consisting of lately. Dude, we never really film in my house anymore. Yeah. I usually go over to Jake's house and film. This throws it back to when I always filmed in my house, making gaming videos or vlogging or whatever. But this is so sick, dude, honestly. I said that like 10 times in this video, but I'm just fangirling right now. You're a girl? Dude, shut up. Did you just assume my gender? I want to ask you guys how you guys like the new editing style because I'm in love with it. And um, yeah, how about you, Jake? I like it a lot. I like the little title cards you give people. Are you doing that every video? Yeah, I'm doing that every video. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Yeah. Not gonna lie, when I saw it, like my name and then you yeah. said music artist, yeah. I was like, Ooh. Yeah. I was like, is it real? Is it happening? Dude, yeah, that's what I'm gonna do for everybody that's in my vlog. Like, I might do Jonah as like a country boy or something like that. I don't know. TikTok. Or, yeah. Uh -uh. I should have did Stephanie as like a TikTok girl or something, but but you did Billy Eilish fan, which yeah. works perfectly. Which works perfectly. Which means she's a TikToker. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I don't know what else we're gonna do tonight. Um, but either way, I will be filming. <laughs> Another thing we're gonna do tonight is I'm gonna set up my Christmas lights in here. I'm gonna go buy two more boxes at Walmart and then might work on my song a little bit more. Yeah, we gonna put up my lights. What is good, guys? We are back here. What's up, bro? 
guys? Quick update. We were watching A New Hope and setting up these lights. We just went to Walmart, me, Noah, and Colin, and we just got two more boxes of the blue LED lights. And starting to set them up. Yeah. There you go. And me and Colin got Gushers, but I also got these Cheez-Its because I think they're tasty. Sick. That was sick. All right, what's up guys? It's currently the next day, the 20th of October right now, and I'm just gonna show you guys the final look of the LED lights that me and Jake set up in my room last night. Yeah, look at this. I'll have to turn off the light to give it more of an effect, but it's all around my room right now. Now let's just turn off the light. Now yeah, that's better. On camera, it looks like it's more purple, but they're blue. It looks so sick. I'm actually proud of this. And then we got my setup right there. That's a really cool shot. I would love that. And I'm thinking about pre-ordering Jedi Fallen Order on my PlayStation. And then on my PC, I'm just currently working on this vlog right now. But yeah, you guys, this is so dope. Wow. Now my background looks like it's purple right now. That's cool. But yeah, you guys, I think that's going to be it for this episode of the vlog. But yeah, anyway, guys, thank you guys so much for watching this vlog. Hope you guys liked it. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you're new. Don't forget to turn on post notifications so you guys know whenever I upload. Turn on all notifications to set up the personalized settings so you get every single upload. I might start streaming as well soon. I just have to buy a new CPU for my PC and just get it rolling on that so I can stream properly on YouTube with OBS and everything like that. That's gonna be coming pretty soon because I have also other things to work on. But yeah, anyway guys, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys later. Peace.